We're right. going to need a lot of masks. On the left-hand side of your screen are the mask makers. There are a lot of them, by the way. But come in, Lauren. Researchers are working on masks that could detect the virus. I want to hear about that. They've actually been working on this at Harvard and MIT for six years, and now they're doing it with coronavirus. So it, it's a mask with a, a sensor inside the mask and a light that lights up if you come into contact with someone who is breathing or coughing or sneezing, and they are infected. It can detect those droplets. Lights up, then you know, move away, get, get out of there. This could be used in emergency rooms, in mass transit, you name it. They'll have a demo, they say, ready in a few weeks' time. In a few weeks? My so, goodness, that's real progress. Yeah. So I'm curious if it becomes the actual mask or if they can just sell the sensor and then you can put the sensor in yeah. another mask. Not sure, but I'd like to know who among me has coronavirus. Imagine technology being able to detect that. So long as it works, changer. I don't want a false positive. I mean, everybody running away from you and there's no need hmm. to run away. I mean, I wouldn't want that. <laughs> so you've got to make sure this thing works, but, you know. All right. Thank you, that Lauren. That is true.